Hi, my name is Susan Hogan and I'm the Chief Operating Officer of the Chicago Children's Advocacy Center. I've had the privilege of serving at the center for the past 10 years and when asked what my eyes have seen in honor of our 10th anniversary, I had like a whole montage of images that came to my mind and I'd like to share some of those images with you. I've seen a brand new building where there was none before and it was bright and clean and empty and I saw it slowly fill with CCA staff and our partner agencies and then the cases started to arrive. My eyes have seen a child kidnapped by a family member, brought to America and held captive for over a year. The CCAC was able to return that child to her home in a remote village in Mexico, accompanied by a mental health therapist. Another image that comes to mind is just seeing one of our drivers tenderly carrying a child into the CCAC building. My eyes have seen the toll the cases can take on the staff that work with these kids and their families staff that stay all day and into the night because they may have to hospitalize a child or find shelter for a suddenly displaced family. I have seen the staff exhausted, but I've seen them return the next day to do it all again. I've seen a child cry because she does not want to leave the loving care of our child life room where they can be safe, be a child, and receive one-on-one -on -one attention. My eyes have seen a politician spending time playing with our children that was not a photo op and that he did not get any publicity from. I've seen volunteers spending countless hours gardening, fundraising, and supporting staff whenever and however they can. I've seen police officers come down the hall and ask for a therapist for a child that they feel is in need. I've seen state's attorneys asking for a backpack because the child had no school supplies. I've seen DCFS investigators cradling a child that was crying and comforting them. I've seen physicians fighting for their patients to make sure that they do not suffer for their harm. I've seen a child skipping down the hallway telling her mother that she wants to come here every day. And I've heard that mother reply, well, you can't come here every day because there are other hurt children that will need to come here as well. When I look back now at this building, it is full, it's crowded, it's dirty, it's worn, but it's a strong foundation and will live again for the next 10 years to serve the children that so badly need us. Thank you for supporting the Chicago Children's Advocacy Center.